This is an old lamp that's been in our family for many, many years, and it's probably seen better days already. It's all dilapidated and needs a new modern look, a new twist to it. So I've decided to spruce it up a bit with a lick of paint, a decorative glow, and a beautiful look to it. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna strip this lamp down. Don't worry about the electrics, leave that in place. But I'm gonna strip it down completely, then just sand it down, and then we're gonna reassemble it. But what I'm gonna do is cut out the fabric of this lamp shade, and then I'm just gonna use the frame as my protective barrier for the globe on the inside. So strip it down and let's get started. But because of the weird shape of the stem of the lamp, what we need is a sanding block. A sanding block is just more manual, easy to get around in tight spaces. No point taking out the orbital sander because it's just gonna get you nowhere fast. So just use ordinary sanding block and sand this whole lamp down. The light stand is sanded down, time for paint. What I love using is this Rust-Oleum chalk paint. It's an ultra matte latex paint, quick drying, easy to apply as well. No need for a base coat or anything like that. Just paint it straight on, wait four hours and give it a second coat. So let's get cracking. time to sort out the lamp shape that's going to be going on top of this lamp. It's very intricate, don't worry, it involves a blade and an old lamp shade, but I'll make it easy for you. The next step in our process is to take an old lamp shade. What we're going to do with this is we're going to cut it up. We're going to take that material right off the frame and that frame is going to form the protective layer around our decorative globe. Just make sure it is old and you have told them this is. The first thing is you're going to need protective gloves. Because we're going to be working with sharp instruments, it's important to protect those fingers of yours. Once the gloves are on, you take a heavy duty blade. And what we're going to do is cut the shade off the frame. Do this very carefully though. It's quite a tricky job. Once you run through, it's quite easy. Once you've sandpapered all the glue off the top of this frame, this is a white frame, but it's not going to look so good on our lampshade. So what we're going to do now is we're going to spray this all black using our Rust-Oleum Gloss Protective Enamel. Then it becomes almost invisible, and this will also form a protective layer around our decorative globe. You'll see what I mean. So now it's time to assemble this light. It's all painted, it all looks good. Let's just put it all together. One quick easy motion, so that goes on. Screw in the locking nut. Now all that's left to do is put this lamp into our shade and look at it. It's a thing of beauty. Five watts and it looks like those old school Edison blows. So you know what to do, get to builders, get it done. Everything I used in this clip is available at your local builders. For more tips and information, visit our website, our social media links, or check out our YouTube channel.